These three men have just been sentenced to death. They were found guilty of assassinating two Scandinavian women on a hiking trip in Morocco last December. Luisa's mother was asking for the death penalty for the three men, and she got what she wanted. It's a fact-based verdict that respects the Moroccan and international law. It is consistent, and we are 100% satisfied when it comes to public action. It was in Morocco's mountainous Atlas region that the two young women, Marin Uland and Louisa Vesterager Jespersen, were abducted by the three men, who claimed allegiance to the Islamic State group. They were later beheaded, with one of the men recording the assassination on a phone. Louisa's mother, who did not attend the trial in Morocco, says the death sentence means justice will be served. It will bring some sort of justice to our daughters. They go around and kill people. Now they will feel what it's like to be sentenced to death. That's the bigger picture I try to focus on. Justice for our girls and our families. And to prevent them from killing again, of course. Last May, 21 other men went on trial for the same case, including on counts of setting up a terror cell. They were all sentenced to between five years and life in prison. As for the three main culprits, although the death penalty is legal in Morocco, the country has had a de facto freeze on executions since 1993.